Sophie, his 13th birthday. Gift, we've got you. Guitar, coming tomorrow. Road game today, surprise party tomorrow. Uh, change of plans. Game tomorrow. No, birthday tomorrow. Hotel, hotel. Guitar, reroute. Birthdays are on birthdays. Party, relocate. UPS My Choice makes rerouting packages easy. Wow. How we're helping companies solve for the needs of customers like Sophie. My first time in foster care, I was four years old. I went back in like third grade, um, and uh, this time it was relative foster care. My grandmother on my father's side, um, who still lives in Orlando, she's still alive and everything. Um, she took me in a relative foster care and. It was just bad. Um, it, things just weren't good at home. The community embraced Quadarius. He's just one of those guys that if he claims you, you're his. And there, it's our family and some other families that opened their hearts and opened their homes to him and really wanted to see him be that success story. I never met someone that like had never, because my family had its issues, of course, like everybody, but it never, was I going house to house or switching? And that really, like, um, I don't know, we all took turns, you know, taking him in and just showing him love in every way possible. I have a lot of families, uh, the A Bears, who've been so great, so great to me. And I mean, we, we've had our differences, but they've been really, really great to me. Quadarius and I met when he was in fourth grade and I was a teacher and he was a student at Lake Silver Elementary in College Park. And I took over a classroom that he was in and um, there was some misbehavior going on in the classroom. And this little boy comes walking up to me and says, Miss Layton, I'm real sorry that the kids are being naughty and I'm gonna help you. Uh, the Teelands, they are actually one of the first families that I've met. Um, besides the Laytons, the Williams, like I said, the Williams, uh, the McGee's, I like, just a lot of family that really took me in under their wings. But this is a man on a mission. He had that fire in his belly that he was going to make his life good.